Hello everyone! This week is book review week, so I thought we should discuss books over a fine box of wine, and we're going to review an old classic. Webster's Dictionary. T. H. Q. The Homo University. Ah, nothing like eight glasses of wine to help you read. Now, anyway, let's get started with the dictionary by Webster. First of all, I want to say I didn't get the plot. I think partially Webster didn't really have much of much to say. I mean, first of all, he put he put the chapters the chapters are titled by letters instead of numbers. Like it's chapter A, chapter B, chapter C, D, E, F, G, and all the let words in the book are in alphabetical order. Okay? Get me? Get me on that? This is how the book begins tells you everything. I mean, it gives you a pronunciation thing, like, like, I don't know how to read, like, it's giving me that crap. Okay, I don't need that shit. I know how to read. Start, let's start with chapter A, B. Let's see how this book begins. I mean, the book is so dumb. Okay, it says, a dictionary of the English language. See that? See right there? Yeah, I know. That's why I picked the book out. That's what I wanted to read, and book in English, my native language. Okay? Starts out with first word. Let's see. I don't know. It's a bunch of mishmash and uh, aardvark. Aardvark. Yep. Aardvark. What happened to Once Upon a Time? Huh? Um. Uh. A large burrowing nocturnal African mammal. That has ex an extent extend style. See, then I couldn't read that word, so I had to look that one up in chat until I found it in chapter E. Stupid. Yeah. So basically, this book is dumb. So basically, you know what I've been doing? I've been using it to press flowers. Yep. And you know what else bugs the hell out of me about this book? They actually came out with a sequel called The Thesaurus. Yeah, there's a sequel to this book. Skip it. I know I did. But you know what? Reading that book really made me think of something. It made me think, wow, I need to drink more. Oh, oh, and get this. Let me tell you the ending. The ending sucked. It's in the shortest chapter of the book. Mm-hmm. Hold on, getting there. Just a second. There's so many pages in this book. It's longer than War and Peace. This is how the book ends. Zymergy. A branch that applied chemistry that deals with the fermentation processes. Absolutely wasteful. Waste of my time. That's what the last word should have been. Waste of time. That's a phrase. So, Maddie K says, Do not read Webster's Dictionary because it's not fun, it's not a page turner, and it makes you feel stupid after reading it. What?